What's going on YouTube? It's me, Tiffany, and I'm here with my co-host, Tanea. Hey, guys. And we are back with an all-new video. I know. It's our last video for 2013. Whoop, whoop. I feel like we've been gone forever, but I told Tanea that we was just on a Christmas vacation. I guess. I guess. I mean, it's really nothing going on right now other than, you know, Beyonce. That's the only thing that I've it been is caring the about lately. season. But anyway, we're here with the last video of the year, which yep. is bittersweet. I'm kind of nervous because I just feel like in 2014, YouTube is going to take us somewhere even farther. I hope. So it's just keep like... Y'all watching all that. Y'all just remember this. So tonight we are here to just have a little chit chat about some of the things that happened this year that we talked about in videos. I went through each video and I pulled out what was interesting to me and Tanea that happened in 2013. And we're going to start off in January with Beyonce singing at the inauguration yep. and being accused of lip syncing. Yep. Let's just set the record straight. She did lip sync, but she did it because she didn't lip sync. Yes, she did. She sang, she sang with the recorded but she, track, but she still, but you still can hear the recorded track more. No, but the, but she she didn't lip sync though. She sang with the recorded track. It's a difference. Lip syncing is like letting it play and you just moving. I'm your just mouth. telling you what Beyonce said. I, I'm telling you what I said. Beyonce said she did this because. Sometimes, I mean, with a program like this, it's like, it can be no mistake. So, like, anything could have happened. Oh, like the wind, yeah. anything. Like, everybody does it. Everybody has a pre-recorded track. But what I'm saying is, she sung also. Okay, that was one of the highlights of 2013. Oh, one that we wanted to talk about. Kim K hey. announced that she was pregnant on um, New Year's Day. Like, early and early in okay, the morning. Can I tell you something? I don't I think I've liked Kim K since she dropped this damn baby. Um, Kim K is definitely one that has changed in 2013. My feelings have changed about her. I'm just hoping that she goes back to... I still to think she's beautiful and I still love her, but I just hate this new Kim. Um, we are from Baltimore, Maryland. The Ravens yes, went we to are. the Super Bowl. Woo -woo! That and was we won really the big. We won. We won. That was something really big that happened for us that we're still dragging along because yes, we would just put out the playoffs. Yep. Yesterday, so but it don't matter because the Steelers was ten. Hi, y'all won, then got put out. But not only did that <laughs> happen. Beyonce, I said, what a coincidence that Beyonce performs at the Super Bowl the year that our team goes what? to the Super because Bowl. Because she is a fan. Which was right around my birthday, so we celebrated that yep. all it was, in one. It was a celebration. It was that a celebration. Weekend. That was really, really fun. And not only did the Ravens make history, so did Beyonce. She yep. also made history. Because so. she made the lights go out. <laughs> um... Ray Lewis, if y'all don't know who Ray Lewis is, he it was on the defense for the Ravens. He was the Ravens' heart and soul. The he retired. The team. He retired after the Super Bowl. The Super Bowl mm. was his last. Um, I just cut myself on this tape. Thank you. That's I like stupid. You um, Ray Lewis retired, and um, still to this day, we're feeling that. So we will miss him. Um, not only did that happen in February, also. Beyonce did her Life is But a Dream documentary. February 16th! And she did the um, Oprah interview in one yep. night. It was Beautiful. That was one of the biggest things for me in 2013 because that was something that I've been waiting for forever. Like, I've been a Beyonce fan forever. I always wanted to know, like, Tricky. what it was like. What was she doing? You know, like, how was the studio? What did it look like when she's in the studio? That was a big thing for the Beehive. So yeah, it really was. That was a Thanks. big, big... Yeah, I'm bleeding. Yes. That was a big, big thing for... Um, and that was also one of the first videos that we got over a thousand views on. Yeah, I was, was looking at it. We got like 3,300 or something that was like a, that. That was a really, really good day. That was, was a good week. Um, Beyonce was a good then ruined our lives by dropping Bow Down, a, a little snippet of Bow Down. Oh, and, it's um, a snippet. Lord, we, we had no idea what was to come, but like I said, that was in February. We are now and in we December. And we just got it in December. But we won't but do I'm that. But I'm chill. Um, Beyonce dro also dropped a Pepsi commercial. That was a big thing for us because we raved over that. We were thirsty, beef. Hey, yeah, I would say, don't forget about um, grown woman. Yeah, like all we got was snippets, and we were, and little clips. It was life, for us. and we did a commercial held us over by the grace of God. That okay. commercial, that life is but a dream, like. 
that's what really held us over. Also, we experienced Rihanna postponing a concert on us, and we also went to our first Rihanna I concert. I wish that wasn't on my list to be able to tell y'all about, honestly. I'm happy that I went to a Rihanna concert because I can say that I went to one, so when I do talk bad about her, it's for a good reason. Um... <laughs> Also, the fair, I don't know if you remember this, the fair Abraham sex tape sex came tape, out. And she only got a million dollars for it. We were really big Teen Mom fans, so that was something big to us because we've just come to the conclusion that they cut off that season of Teen Mom because of Farrah. Yep, and that's not fair because I like Macy. I like Macy. I like, um, who was it? Macy. And I like, um, Tyler and, um... Yeah, 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 Caitlyn. Caitlyn. With little Carly. Yeah, yeah. so... I liked Farrah, too. But look out for 2014. She will be... Actually, yeah. 2014 because this Thursday starts the new show that she's on couples therapy. Really don't know why she's on couples oh. therapy. Sarah. Well, you know Caitlyn and Tyler was on it the last season. Yeah, but I don't, don't know who she's with. All I know is she's a whole name. I think it's the guy that she did the porn tape with because it was supposedly her boyfriend. Um, we also went through the trial of um the George mm, Zimmerman mm, 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 Trayvon mm, mm, Martin case, which was and still is a horrible, horrible thing. Yes, the verdict was bad. Yeah. But karma, you know, because George Zimmerman ended up going to jail anyway. Ain't he back on? And oh, I don't know, but he went, and his wife divorced him. So hey. I mean, you reap what you sow. Y'all know how I feel about that, and if you don't know, go back to that video because I went off. I will never forget for the rest of my life the day that I watched that trial and the verdict and where I was. I was in Aunt Luann bedroom yep. by myself watching it and I screamed to the top of my lungs because that man is guilty and he should have. And then we went to go get pizza and she was mean to our little waitress. Okay. Um, Beyonce also ruined our lives by making us think that she got this fabulous haircut. So we had to come. She ruined my life because I ain't believe her. We had to come on YouTube and act a fool because so many people were talking about her haircut but all along it was for the videos and she still wins um scandal entered my life let's talk about scandal entered my life scandal entered my life in june it, it, it the second season actually ended in may someone sold me the dvds in june and the rest is just history i love olivia pope she loves me i love scandal i'm scandal obsessed and it was also when I discovered, like, Tanea loves the, you know, Tanea thinks that I go through these phases and I'm overly obsessed with things and then I just get rid of it. But no, like, Beyonce and Kerry Washington, Kerry Washington just joined the team. Um, I've been a, Curry, a fan of her work, but, like, Kerry Washington is without a doubt. 2013 has made me discover she, she is my favorite actress. She ain't gonna watch none of her movies until she filmed. Um, excuse what me, I've seen, seen plenty what of movies her movies. I've seen plenty what of her movies. What movie did you go to the theaters to go watch? Um, oh, okay. Um, At any rate. But anyway. And I just, I'm, I'm not saying that like you, I said, you do away with them. You just get obsessed. With like I said, I'm a really I'm so big fan of Kerry Washington's now. Um whatever she might say it doesn't matter because i know it don't matter i know I how i feel sick. whatever i love Kerry washington i love scandal scandal's on a break right now but like i said it into my life it changed my life and i'm completely utterly and obsessed it just changed my life i don't know like people y'all don't know what i'm going through y'all don't know what scandal I'm did for true, true anyway before she kills my vibe and we end this video on a bad note along with the year but we went to go see Beyonce three times this year, yep. which was really, 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 really a blessing. Yes, it was. Thank you, Lord. It was really a blessing. I don't know, like, I can't pick which one was my favorite because all of them were my favorite. Yeah, I can't pick which one was my favorite. I want to say, okay, it's definitely out of, no, I was going to say it's out of Atlantic City, in DC. But I yeah. really, really enjoyed Philly though. No, I was gonna say Philly is my least favorite only because of how long we I was waited like, in the that heat was and stuck but to people. I really enjoyed it and like I wanna go to Made in America again. So like I want that was nice, but that was gonna be like my least. And then I wanna say um De um December is in the middle because I had saw most of it except for when she did the new surprise of EXO. And that was nice, but Atlantic City just took the cake. I saw her do 
um, Why Don't You Love Me for the first time live. And Amazing. My life hasn't been the same. True that. I'll tell you that. Um, also, we started our Scandal reviews, which... For some reason, Scandal... Like, it's like when I put up a Beyonce video, we get a thousand views. If I put up a Scandal review... We get reviews and comments and reviews. And it's just been such a blessing that to share, you know, our excitement with you guys. And I'm so excited. Like, I have all these friends on YouTube and Twitter about Scandal. You guys look forward to the review, which pushes me to do the review. Because I'm telling y'all, at the Scandal go off, I literally could go straight to bed and yes, just lay there. Yes, because I have to because go to work the next morning. I'm drained. 12 o'clock And I'm flipping out. Like, I do it for y'all whatever. But I love the Scandal Tuesday. reviews. And I love my Olivia Pope shirt. I think I'm going to wait on New Year's Day. Yep. Um, The TLC yeah, movie nice. came out, which for years we had been hearing it was a TLC movie coming out. And it was actually pretty good. Yep. I on I personally, I said it when it first came out. Well, when it was about to come out. I thought it should have been in the movies. I said it shouldn't have been in the movies because I definitely was not going to see it in the movies. I would have wanted to see it but in the it movies. But it was good to come on VH1. But I wasn't paying ten fifty to go see that. I would have went to see it. And T-Balls and Chili, y'all really need the money. And you know what? And so does Little Mama. Shout out to Little Mama. She did Keep good. Keep on saying that Little Mama was born to play Left Eye's role. I'm still not over you getting on the stage with Jay-Z, but that's just me. You have to. You um, have to speaking of a stage, we went through the Miley Cyrus era. Hannah Montana is gone. <coughs> Hannah Montana is gone. 2013, she, she buried her. And put her in the grave. Molly did so much in 2013. From popping her ass to stages. To wearing little buns. To smoking a blunt on stage. You know. Just doing the freaking She's most. part of like Taylor Gang. She's hanging with Juicy J. I really don't know what's going on. Uh, it was a rumor um, that Juicy J was her baby daddy. But that was a lie. She was in such a good relationship with the guy from the Hunger Games though. True ski. He but was cute. You know. He was with Hannah Montana. He yeah, and then Molly he found Thomas. out this new smoking Molly, and he was like, uh-uh. Right. Which was, which goes to the, um, I said my favorite Speaking awards. Speaking of the Hunger Games, that was probably the best movie of 2013. Sorry. That's good. That's good. I mean, I don't, I don't think it was another movie that I, no, it was another movie. Oh, what movie the best, the best, um. The, the best, best man, man holiday was good. That was but a good movie. But it was, it's, it, well, it's not even in the same category as. So I'll say the best yeah. two was the Hunger Games and the best man. No, because then um, my Something baby else come out the other day. Yeah. I mean, um, I believe Kevin Hart came out with something. Kevin Hart was, was good too. I'm in love with him. It was a lot of good movies. Yeah, um, true. But I was going to say, for me, I didn't know what to name pick, but I went through and I said for me, the MTV Awards were my favorite awards. Oh, yeah. me too! I love the, in the NSYNC thing. That tore me up. That bro. Justin Timberlake that whole Justin Timberlake Blake thing in the MTV awesome. Awards sold me over like... Hold on, what awards was it with Charlie Murphy? Charlie, um, Charlie Murphy? Not Charlie Murphy. So, um, <laughs> Ch Charlie Ch Wilson. Charlie Wilson. I can't, was it a BET award? Whatever it was. He was good. Love. That was good. That was really, really good. Um, Charlie Murphy. And we're ending it with the most important... Beyonce dropped her fifth album at the end of the year. She dropped it. I think it's been two weeks now. Can I just say, like, you remember when we first did the video? If you haven't seen it, go back and watch when we first did the review and we said it was fresh. It was. It had only been, like, less than 24 hours and we did a review on it. Okay, now we're in a whole new world because we're two weeks in and it's still... I still feel the same amazing. place. Amazing! It's the only thing I listen to. I tried to listen to Drake the other day and I just turned it off. I tried to listen to the radio. I've tried to watch TV. Nothing's working. I don't want to hear nothing. If it's not Beyonce's new album, I don't want to hear it's it. It's amazing. We stopped listening to Chris Christmas music. Like yeah, me. I stopped listening to Y'all just don't understand. The other day And Rocky is still my favorite song. Partition is I can't pick a favorite, but Partition Rock, is at the I top did, of the list. I did. Rock Partition is my, is my favorite. favorite. But not the um, video, video. on Rocket. I like song. video I like the video of Rocket. I mean I like the video of Rocket, but I like the song better. If you have not gotten the album yet You aren't living. Where are you? I don't know. I feel like the only person that shouldn't have this album is my grandmother. And that's because she's too churchy. But other than that, everybody should have this album. So now we're going to talk mm -hmm. about... Hold on, because mm -hmm. someone's trying to call me. I'm going to have to decline them. I know she's going to be mad. 
Um, I wanted to talk about some of the best albums that came out in 2013. And I put um, Tamar, Justin Timberlake, Jay-Z, Yeezus, Drake, The Dream, Fantasia, and Beyonce. Did I miss anybody you like? Um, nah, that was it. Um, oh, did, no. Did that come out this year or last year? Wiz came out this year. No, I'm Wiz came out this year? Yeah, we downloaded it. I, I, was know, I thought that was last year. Wiz, if you came out this year, that too, because you helped me down. Did Taylor Swift come out this year? With I don't bang with her. Yeah, I don't, don't bang with her. Um, but if I had to choose out of those, of course, the top would be Beyonce. Next would be um, Jay Z. Then would be Drake. Then would be Yeezy. Then yeah. would be Fantasia. Then would be The Dream. Oh, I don't know where to put Justin Timberlake. I can't put him in order. Cause he, yeah, he doesn't. Um, I can't put him in order. But um, if you didn't get those albums this year, you really missed out. Again, Tamar, Justin Timberlake, Jay Z, Kanye West, Drake, The Dream, Fantasia, and Beyonce. Yeah, he came out because that was right around the time I moved. No, Red came out in twenty twelve. I love that album. And what? Wiz Khalifa. What album? Only Nigga in Purse. That's the only nigga in Purse. It came out in twenty twelve. I'm on it. Whenever it came out, I loved it. I, <laughs> I loved it. Um, but yeah, what is, what's your order? What? Of the CDs. What was your favorite CD? This year? Beyonce. Then, um... Jay-Z, Yeezy, Drake, or Kanye? Jay-Z, Yeezy, Drake. I, would, I personally would have to say Beyonce, Drake. Um... Jay-Z than Yeezy. Yeah, you have it, Beyonce. She put Drake over your husband. She put him in the album, so it don't matter. True that. <laughs> True that. Um, but that's pretty much all that happened. Um, I wanted to say our favorite videos from um this year that we did. My top three favorite videos that we recorded. Yes. Number I love one. Oh, go ahead. One number one for me would definitely have to be the Beyonce documentary because. It was I, just the bomb. Oh, I meant to tell y'all too. We lost the co-host. She's over on the couch. Yeah. I mean, we really didn't lose her, but she's no longer on the we camera. We definitely didn't lose her. You know, but every now and then in 2014, I'm hoping that we can call her on for special guests. 2014, I plan to let friends come on and come as a um, guest co-host because all of my friends and people that I know always say, "When can I come on the show? When can I come on the show?" Those would be the days that I probably won't be on. Today is mean. No, I'm just saying. I feel like the show is fine how it is. We Today had three. It didn't work out, so stick to two. But it's a guest co-host. It's not forever. It's just a show. And you know this one. Uh, we'll talk about it later. All right. My favorite. Are you done with your favorite shows? Um, I just recorded? did my number one. You can go next. Um, mine was definitely Blue Ivy's hair. <laughs> I went off on that ass. Come for me again. Um, the Budweiser Made in America video was fun. Yeah, that was fun. Khadija was in it. And... Oh, I got my second. My second is when we went to go see Beyonce in Atlantic City because I shimmy my shoulders. And, um, our mom was on the bed drunk. Yeah, and crazy. Ashley passed out. Oh, and the other one is, I'm looking at it now, it says Team Mom 2 season finale, because we had Joey, and he that was wasn't a fun so video. crazy. That he was not Pepsi. a fun video. That was a fun video, and Sierra's body party, we was talking about that, that was a fun video. Um, I have to say, I set my two. I have to say the third one would be one of our scanner reviews, it was the, um, it was either Everything is Coming Up Melly or Ramon is for Lovers 2. One of them, we went crazy. Like, we lost it. And it's about 30 comments on it. Because people were just like, y'all are so crazy. Like, I even put some of the videos on Vine. It was really fun. But I had a lot of fun sticking to YouTube. Because before, I, I told you I had a YouTube mm -hmm. channel before. And I plan to stick with it. And, I mean... I just feel like we must be doing something right. Everybody that comes and talks to us in person, they're just like, oh my God, it should be oh cameras goodness, following so you guys. Show it should be a reality show. show. Yes, they are secret viewers. I, you know, learned that all year long because they'll slip up and say something that I said in a video or, you know, I've just seen people and they'll just be looking at me like, hmm. Oh she my seems God! Different from it's videos. so many people who I'd be like, Tiffany, what? Who do you know her? And just staring like, oh, at our face. She watch our video. Yeah, Girl, that's weird. 
weird. That's weird. Yeah, y'all should just start to in say the hi. corner, like mug, me mugging. I mean, Stop hey, it. but if y'all just want to be a secret watcher, that's fine with me. Too. I mean, that's fine. It's just weird. Um, we also got our intro recently from our new producer, so I'm hoping that Slash we get to do. Uncle is the bomb. He is. Com. Shout out to Uncle Al. I'm Uncle. hoping that we can do lots of new things, things in 2014. Uncle Al. Yeah. And in 2014, I just plan to be. Um, I plan. I can't think of a word. I just plan to make sure that I, we do do two videos every two weeks. What is it called? To be more productive. Not productive. Okay. More, I I plan to be dedicated more than ever to YouTube That's in 2014. Up. I really do. Oh, in 2014, I plan um to be the same person because I really like me, except for like my extra chin and this um one big love handle on the side. I don't like that, but um and to get more money. But other than that, I'm fine. Oh, I wasn't giving my personal ones. It was nice to oh. see you. We did that last year. If you want to get a good kiki, a good laugh, go watch our 2013 first video of the year. Go watch it. When I look at that video, I'm just like, where did the time go? Like, it seems like it's yesterday. really been like 11 months since. Ugh, that's just crazy. And I, you know, the year just goes by so fast. And I just just plan to be more productive in every point of my life. Everything yep. in my life needs more. Um, Fine tuning. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. All of that. Mm -hmm. But yeah, like I said, so. Maybe in 2014 I'll find me a man. Mm hmm. Or no, a man will find me. Because I'm not Ooh, looking. That's what, that's what the Bible says. A man that finds a wife is a good F thing. Finds a good thing, honey. And okay. Finds a great thing. Well, this video is getting long, but I just want to give a shout out to anybody who watched any of our videos Thank in 2013. You. If you Rainbow share the video, cut. if you like um, the video. Cool, I was just looking at your names and I knew I wanted to say them. If you like the video. Our white friend that was watching the video. If you believed in us. If you do believe in Hold us. On. If you left a comment. If you disliked it and you came back to watch another. And if you told a friend like I tell y'all every time. Shout out to Ashley. Ashley is the one who started out ending to the videos. If you don't know, there's no show like this show. And it's really no show like the show. So. It really isn't. We try to be as different as, as possible. Have you found them because we're about to end this? Oh, oh I mean, well, no. But y'all know who y'all are. I, um, I just want to give a shout out to Rainbow Cut, you know Patty name. Quinn, Adrian. Yeah, Patty Quinn. That's the name I'm um, looking for. The girl who calls me Rosie. Yes, that's funny. She's um, so my name, um, I can't, I don't know how to pronounce it. It's A-R-R-O-Z. Errol's like Errol's compoil, something like that. That means rice. You comment a lot. You comment a lot. I love you. I love anybody who watches. Shout out to my family who watches this all the time. Shout, Shout out, out to my Greek family Lynette. who watches it and then tells people that they watch it, but don't tell me that they watch it. Shout out to Ashley because Ashley is still a big part of the show today. Fix your face, but she don't watch it. You don't watch the show, and she don't give us no thumbs up. Yes, I watch your show. Okay, yes. so we're gonna go. We hope that y'all had a good Christmas. Hey, y'all, just decided to come and squash this. She hit my butt. Come on, you know that she ain't right. So y'all know y'all miss me, so I just came back because somebody. I hope y'all had a so good y Christmas. Y'all see my tweets. This is that. And, and we hope that you about. have a happy new year. We love you. Ashley, won't you take us out? So, you guys, once again, you already know it ain't no show like the show. Happy New Year! How we take this thing out? Y'all don't say y'all on his mouth like liquor. Y'all don't say. Did you push? It's the red button. The red one, actually.